there's a collector for everything nowadays. Yes, so, sir. No idea if it works. Though. 1500 bucks. That'd be completely crazy. <laughs> Some guy has eight of them for $699. Yeah, I saw that. I'll give you 50 bucks for it. I'm not exactly sure what I just bought. Welcome back everyone to another episode. Now, before we jump into this video here, I wanted to go ahead and share something with you guys. Last week, I made a post about some designer handbags. Now, I've been getting a lot of people sending me messages through Instagram asking, do we ship outside of California or is it a local pickup only? Yes, we do ship outside. One of the bags has already sold and it actually got shipped outside the States. So we do take shipping orders. Now, the way it works, we will take payment. We'll go ahead and verify your address. We will make sure to get insurance on the package and we need signature confirmation. So once the payment has cleared, we will go ahead and ship the item out to you. All you need to do is make sure you guys verify the address and we do need a phone number for contact purposes. So keep that in mind. But we do take orders. We've been getting a ton of messages regarding them. And we do have some more designer stuff coming out actually in the next week or so. This is just a sneak peek. So we will have a wallet and we will have a matching, just a sneak peek handbag that will be available soon i will make a post about that on our instagram and i might throw a short up on our youtube channel as well but in the meanwhile we just passed 800 subscribers so we are almost at a thousand we'll be giving away the silver rounds and also we'll have some other uh nice giveaways to show our appreciation but if you haven't done so yet hit the subscribe key comment below and let's jump into this video. I bought something that I hadn't bought in the past. I took a little gamble on it. Let's see how it pans out. I will keep you guys updated when I do post it and let you guys know what we sell it for and what the total profit is because you guys do see what I end up paying for the merchandise when I take it in. So I hope you guys enjoy the next episode and I'll see you guys in the next one. Treasure chest. So you said how old are these? 60s, huh? Interesting. They're pretty. They were my dad's. So these are all the cars, or is there more? Yeah, this is all the track. track. And okay. Man, what the hell is on that? That's the old foam. That so you just that. kept it like that with the foam, huh? Yeah. No, man. I don't know if that's good or bad. It might be good. You never know. Can I take one out? Absolutely. There's one out of the box right there. I want to see what the foam did to this. See, this one's shape. These are probably supposed to be like that. So they're all the same cars, huh? Pretty much. Let me look at one of these that have the foam on there to see what type of... Oh, man. Shit. See? My dad passed away about 15 years ago. Mm. So you left this? You found this probably in the garage? I'm going to go with smoke. I mean... So this is the only one that's different. I think this one's different too. Uh, yeah. I don't know. These are convertible. I figure I'll let somebody else have some fun with them or somebody could be a collector, I don't know. There's a collector for everything nowadays. Yes, so, sir. So this is the HO scale? Yeah. All right, so let's leave this here. Let me look up a couple things on this. Then I got a, like a Milwaukee train, uh, uh, what is that? Oh, I can't think. Transfer pump, you want to get rid of? Newer one or older? Newer. It's brand new? Never been used or? It's used. It's used. Let me look this up here. This is, no idea if it works. Yeah, because there's also parts, you know, I don't know. Yeah. I don't even want to dick with it. Is this the transformer? These are the triggers probably to release the cars? Do all the speed. Yeah. And there's a box in there. That's How do we know if this thing works? Good question. What's going to happen if I plug it in? No wires well, are touching, think, right? I think uh, we're missing something here. 
But I want to see if this is going to at least get a buzz. Something. And we'll just keep the wire away from each other. Be you careful. Know, you only got one, so. Um, I don't even know how we can. What? Yeah, you, you feel it, right? Yeah. Yeah, all right. So that might be good. There's something going on in there. All right, let me look up a couple things. I just need one of these. The cars, I already know what's up. You got another controller here. You notice there's two of them there. The tracks don't really go for much. Very inexpensive. I mean, you got boxes of them for like 40, 50 bucks. Yeah. Let me look up these cars, because it's funny how I'm typing in the full title and nothing pulls up for the car. I've seen them online for like, well, in mint condition, of course, but some site I went to, they were 1500 bucks. I'm like, holy smoke. You know which ones are 1500 bucks? The ones that are, they're pretty intense. They're yeah. Quite elaborate oh, yeah. I think these are not, I don't think these are worth a lot of money. No? No, these are like just generic cars. The ones that are going for a decent amount are like sports cars and I found them more on this computer here for some reason. I don't know. Funny thing is, I can't even find a single one that looks like. <laughs> did you notice that? <laughs> yeah. None of them look like the ones you have. Not a single one. Look, these, like for example, even these here don't look like it. So let's do a reverse image search. The transfer pump, I would pass, bro. Yeah. Yeah, I get those brand new sometimes. Use this hard to determine whether it works and when I sell it to a client they also question the functioning well, of it. It works. I know. I've got two of them. I don't need two of them. Just hard for me to show a client of mine that it works. They'll usually take it and then if something doesn't work on it, unfortunately, I have to honor a return. Alright, so let me just take a picture of this and see if it finds anything. What about a Garmin? Nah, no one does. No, one no, no I know. Your iPhone killed that market. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. You want a charger? I got a ton of those. I uh, hear you. Uh, the car's in mint condition, brand new. They're like 30 bucks. The full size of a guy that has every single one and every single version of it. Wow. Different colors, look at that. Prices are right there. The one you have, the closest one is right there. And yours, this has a red hat. $34.99 brand new. Yours is a black hat. But the, you know what the only issue I'm having with this one here that you have? It doesn't look like the underside is a little bit different than the ones, the originals. I'm trying to figure out how come it doesn't say anywhere on here. Aurora, you know what I mean? Not a single one with the black cap. Not a single one. Uh, with the uh, red cap. Red hat. Yeah. And also even the guy looks a little bit different just weird wheels off of this one man you might have a tough time finding these just being honest with you man these tracks aren't worth a lot yeah nothing bro this uh, one i can't even find that's weird see again this one's a different one and it's funny none of them have a black cap they're all red caps i don't know what that means yeah, i don't think my dad back in the day he'd paint them no, no, I highly yeah. doubt it. Yeah, yeah, no one's gonna go through the trouble of right. painting all this. Yeah, that'd be completely crazy. <laughs> you know, that's it, a taking it to hobby the tool, extreme. Hobby yeah, yeah, whole other level. That batch there, I would be interested, but the price you're asking, I personally wouldn't touch them because I might buy them, and stuff like this usually tends to sit Shit. around for a very yeah. long time. Only reason why is because you gotta find the right buyer. Right. It's not like it's an iPad or you know. A TV or something where people see electronics and it's a good price they'll buy it right some people I'm gonna be honest with you I had no knowledge about these myself Aurora modeling slot cars and none of the ones that are going for those prices the ones we're seeing there some guy has eight of them for six hundred and ninety nine dollars yeah I saw that Wait, you saw the cars mm -hmm. they're completely different cars this seems like it's just the cars that came with that model Maybe like a kit, you know? Well, I know my dad wouldn't have the track and all that. Ah, it's a cool piece. I can take a $50 gamble on it, but at that point, again, I'd probably post it starting at a lower price. And you give me 50 bucks for it, I'll take it. I'll give you 50 bucks for it. 
Cool. Give me your ID and I'll give you 50 bucks for it. That's fine. Maybe we can find it at home. All right. Somebody might enjoy it. I know. Someone might, you know, find it amusing. Yeah. Someone might be a collector. It might take a long time for it to sell. You never know. Right. You got more uh, vendors than I do. It's worth a gamble to you. You've been here a while, huh? I've been here a while now, yeah. It's your first time in here, huh? No, I was in here a while back. I was looking for a, a jackhammer. I see. I want a jackhammer. Battery wanna... operated. Yeah. What brand? Who makes that? I think it's Milwaukee. It is. My kind of work, that's what I need. I'm in the trenches and I don't need a 30, 60 pound jackhammer in the trench, man. Yeah. It's like, no, nah, that's too much, man. Can you give me a right thumb in here, please? Just hold it there for me for a second or two and I'll let you know when it's going to sign. Good. You see the rain stopped. For now. Perfect. Also, you don't have like a pre operated weed eater, do you? No nah, man, that one over there, I don't have the batteries for. You see the orange one? To the right. Yeah, I need the batteries for it. it. Unit works, but the battery and the charger, I'm not asking for much for it. You can find the battery and charger, I think at um, one of the, uh, maybe Lowe's, I think, or something. What is that, Echo? No, it's an Atlas. Now look it up, if, I, if you find it, I'm only asking 20 bucks for it. Is that right? That's it. Thank you, sir. Anytime, brother. Nice meeting you, man. Same here. For sure, bro. Have a great day. Yeah, I run across some shit once in a while. Yeah, let me know. If you come across anything you're interested in getting rid of, I'd be willing to deal. All right. Yeah, I'm open, brother. Nice meeting Have you. Have a great one. You too, sir. Thank you. So there you have it. I'm not exactly sure what I just bought, but I think this is the first time I'm actually buying slot cars here at the shop. But... I found it interesting. For $50, I took a gamble. It might pay off, it might not, who knows. But in this game, you always gotta take some risk. And I think this one's well worth it. What I like about the, uh, this whole complete set is the fact that it comes with a lot of tracks. Uh, we got the curved, we got the straight, we got the control module, transformer, the release triggers, and we got about one, two, three, four, five, six cars in their original plastic case one is outside one of them is damaged with the wheel off but we got i noticed three different variations of this car and what's cool about it is it might add some value as a collector if you buy it it still has the original foam that was encased with the car so it might make for a good sale and also each one still has the original tags on them showing what the car is which is kind of cool. So I'll keep you guys updated. If anyone out there knows a thing or two about these, we would love to hear from you guys. So please do me a favor, drop in the comments what you guys know about this. And when we sell it, we'll keep you guys updated what we get for this, but we would definitely appreciate it. Keep watching, got a lot more content coming your way.